Hey guys, it's Brian and Jeff here with Blaze Bite. We are at the Red Rose Cafe here on Madison Avenue in Lakewood. We had uh, Matt and Mike suggest this place. I heard that they have six dollar dozen wings every day, all day. All day, every day. How awesome is that? And I heard pictures of Miller Lite, so let's go check it out. All right, let's go. Hey guys, it's uh, Jeff with Blaze Bite. We're at the Red Rose Cafe. I have Bryant and Matt with me today. How you doing? What's going on? We're gonna try some awesome wings. Matt, oh, you suggested them, right? They will be good. I promise you they will impress. Place. All right. I'll tell you what, the price is right. That's for sure. So what? Can't beat six bucks a dozen. Yeah. We have three flavors. What flavors are we trying out? All right. So we got bourbon here. That's gonna be our mildest. Then we've got a medium garlic which is one of Matt's favorite, Matt Hughes. And then we've got a hot barbecue, which is recommended by our lovely waitress. Do you prefer a, a drumette or a flat? I'm normally a flat guy, but the drums are big here, and you can't go wrong. This is a one of those sticky sauces. It's a, yeah. A glazy. Glaze sauce. We call this a glazy sauce. It's very, it's very sweet. Mm-hmm. No heat, a little bit of a crisp. I would say medium to large size wings. That was really crispy. I can't sit there yet. All right, you guys ready? Yep. Flip them. Cool. So I did a 6.8, 7.4, and a 6.0. Brian, you want to start off? Yeah. Um, so I had a 7.5 for size wise, which I think we were pretty close. He was a 9. I was a 7.5, you were a 7.2. I had a 5.8 for uh, flavor. I felt like it was good, but I just felt like I was missing something with that. Me and Brian were pretty close on our last three critiques. Um, I just had a little bit bigger on the size. Obviously, I haven't done like many normal. Come on, the wings or something else. <laughs> hey. I thought the flavor was great for a sweet sauce. I liked it. If you don't like anything with kick, it would be perfect. So, um, crispiness, 7-2, and uh, no heat, so 1. So I think we're all in agreement. Yep. Cool. All right, this one is a medium garlic, uh, a.k.a. Matt's favorite, Matt Hughes. So I'm going to let Matt take the first one out of this. You can definitely taste the garlic. Mm -hmm. It's got buffalo sauce. Yeah. I like when my garlic farm has buffalo. Oh, it's great. A lot of people just do butter as a base. It seems like they're garlic. Is like minced up a little bit more. Does that make sense? Some of the other wings that we've had, it was like bigger chunks of garlic on top. This is almost like a nice, it looks like Parmesan cheese, but it's definitely Parmesan and garlic all over it. Go ahead, Jeff, you go first yeah. this time. All right, I'll go first. What's your overall? Eight, 7.2, 8.7. .7. Wow. A little different. Yeah. Um, I gave the size. Mine was smaller that time. I think I grabbed a small one. I wasn't looking at. So, but it was still above average. I gave it a six point two. Um, the sauce. I I like garlic parm, and we've tried a lot of different ones. I gave it a seven four. I thought it was definitely good. The crispiness was still crispy, and the heat level. It, I don't know if you guys noticed, but it started lingering. Like, yeah. It's still with me. Yeah. It's been a, a couple of minutes. So. I, I thought 5.2 and an overall was a 7.2 for me. So I gave it an 8.0 overall. I uh, love the fact that they mixed the buffalo. They used the buffalo sauce as a base for the garlic farm. So that part I liked. I gave it an 8.1. The particular wing I had was uh, large. Uh, 8.4 was the sauce. I love that the, the garlic is like minced up more, so you're not getting like seeds of garlic. It's actually like you know more palatable i feel like and um i love the hot sauce as a base so i really like the sauce um, i stuck with the nine as a size um, i gotta pull another big drum out of there flavor for me is an 8.5 it's obviously my go-to wing so that might be a biased rating here crispiness i actually went lower on this one with the 7.5 and i think it is with the parmesan on there the garlic and i do like you said i love the buffalo sauce that's on there as a base um i went with a heat rating of a 3.3 Wow. Uh, I might have a little higher tolerance of heat than you guys. I don't know. The <laughs> final flavor at the Red Rose Cafe is going to be your delicious hot barbecue. Okay. You can find that one out. right here in this basket. I feel like I'm pretty um, 
I don't know, pretty subjective on my barbecue sauces. Um, I don't know if this is my favorite barbecue sauce for the base. It's starting to, I'm starting to feel the Yeah, kick now it's, yeah. I don't know if that was that much hotter than the parm, though. The garlic parm hot medium. Ready? Go. All right. 7-0. 7 7-7. There you go. Matt? All right. So, I gave it a 7-7 seven, seven overall. Um, I took a flat this time. The size wasn't quite there like it was on the drumsticks that I had previously. I did like the sauce. I like a little more kick. I'm not necessarily always a barbecue guy. I prefer my buffalo sauces, mild, medium, hot. Um, crispiness, the flat was a little less crispy than the drumsticks I had. And the heat level I gave it a 5.1. A little over halfway there. For 7.7. Seven, seven. I did a 7.0 uh, overall rating. And I felt like the size on that particular wing I grabbed was about a six and a half. Flavor in the sauce, I give it a 7.2. I was a little disappointed in the barbecue itself. I love that it's hot and barbecue, but uh, I don't know. I don't know if I'm a big fan. I mean, I liked it, but it wasn't my favorite barbecue sauce. And then crispiness, I didn't feel any crisp on that. Maybe it's because it's our last wing we're reviewing, but it's five and a half. And then the heat level, it was a hot barbecue, so I, it was the hottest one we've had today. I gave it a 7.8. So I gave it a size. Mine was bigger this time, and I think it's because I got a, a drum. Yep. So I gave it a 7.8 sauce. Um, again, I, I'm with Brian. This wasn't my favorite barbecue sauce, but I love the kick. Yeah. I think the kick was perfect for me. It was at, I, I gave it a 7.2. I thought it was, mine wasn't that uncrispy. I gave it a 7.2. I thought it was still decently crispy, but my overall rating was a 6.9. If you guys haven't liked us on Facebook, please do so. If you haven't subscribed to our YouTube channel, we'd appreciate it if you do that. We're on um, Twitter. We're on all, all the social media platforms. So. We got 338 followers. Okay. Yeah. We need to get that number to 1,000. And then Matt's going to come eat the triple atomic wing with us. Sure, why not? So, cool. Thanks, He's rating for probably a four on that one. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys. Thank you so much for joining us. Yep. Cheers. Right. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers.